And the eyes of them both were opened, and they knew that they were naked. And they sewed fig leaves together and made themselves aprons. So it is written in the Bible that Adam and Eve made aprons in the Garden of Eden. Hello everybody. Today I'm going to talk about aprons. In past centuries, most women wore just a plain work apron all day long, unless you were an elite wealthy lady who could choose to wear a fancy apron with embroidery and lace. Number two is a charity peg doll wearing a fancy gauze and net lace apron with 18th century style ball gown made of green silk brocade. Another plain charity, number three, is an antique reproduction peg doll made in China. She's dressed in her original brown check dress and pink ribbon bonnet, and her clothes need a fashion makeover. Let me remove this doll here so that you can see Charity's fashion makeover. She has a fancy gauze apron that will dress up this gown. It's a pinner apron that has patched pockets decorated with fanciful trim that was fashionable in the 1780s. The pink bonnet ribbon was removed from Charity's original bonnet and some lace was sewn onto the bonnet ruffle. Number four seated is Hagar, a reproduction peg doll. She's wearing a cotton lawn apron with fine embroidered flowers and matching neckerchief, or should I say handkerchief, because a vintage lady's handkerchief was cut and fashioned to fit Hagar's petite wood body. There are some vintage handkerchiefs there that you can see that were turned into a doll apron. Number five is an antique peg doll wearing a Regency style orange silk apron with pouch pockets. Notice her 1820 style straw poke bonnet. Number six in the black apron is smartly dressed in a Regency style cotton lawn apron trimmed with black lace. Clipped on the apron waistband is a dressmaker chatelaine. Number seven and eight are antique Grodner tall dolls. Both are wearing 1830s style silk gowns with silk bonnets. One apron is made of plaid silk and one apron is made of embroidered net lace. And numbers nine and 10 are special guest dolls, George and Martha Washington. These are original China doll clothes made for them. But George and Martha need to wear an apron and their clothes need a little makeover too. Let me remove these to show the makeover. Mr. Washington has a new black wool coat and because he was a Freemason, he wears a decorated Masonic apron. Mrs. Washington's makeover clothes are a lovely embroidered apron and handkerchief made from a vintage handkerchief. An extra bit of lace was sewn around her bonnet. Thanks for watching this video. I'm Rainy Von Hohen, dressmaker for Peg Wood Dolls. Thanks for watching again.